Hello and welcome back to another Space Engineers Mod Showcase video. Now in the background, what you are seeing is the mono single tracked vehicle. Yes, that's right. This has one single wheel and it pulls itself along using this lovely little track. Now this is all entirely made from vanilla blocks. There was the option of downloading additional mods to make it even better, but I chose to keep it vanilla because I generally like keeping these mods a vanilla based showcase apart from the odd few which need to have extra mods. So this thing is absolutely incredible to actually drive. I do recommend you actually try it yourself because it is a real feat of engineering. It does have weapons on it, it does have a little cockpit hidden in there and it does have thrusters if you need it. And we will of course have these little stands right here which are to keep us balanced. Now the block destruction has been turned off in the world because it cannot be used without it otherwise you'll just destroy this entire vehicle when you try and move it along. So I'm going to go hop in here and show you what we have on our menu. So we have a missile launcher right here. So if I tilt the camera around, we have the missile launchers right here, which will then fire off into the distance. We killed the tree. How lovely. And then number two, we have a machine gun right there. Number three, we have an auto turret, which is sitting on the side right there. We then have an antenna if we need it. We have a number five camera, which is just below the machine guns. We have a six camera, which is just above the machine guns. We have seven, which is a thruster, and number nine releases the brakes for the actual single track to move. So I come out of that camera and go to the third person. Actually, before we go for a little ride, let me just say that if you have the parking brake on, as you can see here, it does stop you from moving. And also, this is why the block destruction has to be turned off in the actual world settings, because you can see there that that wheel is rubbing up against those blocks, and they are going to break if you have it enabled. So let's undo the blocks and just go for a little ride. So here we go here, this is how it works. We're just pulling ourselves along, the wheels are turning the little track, and the tracks are going along the ground. If I press number seven to turn on the thrusters, we should maintain some more balance as we go through this little thing. We use the mouse to steer, unfortunately. You can't use left or right on the actual keyboard, you have to use your mouse, and it is very wavy with the whole turning. That's why we have those little stands there to stop us from actually going all the way over. I bring the HUD back and go to the number five view. This is what we look like. So we can come across here, we can start shooting. It's very difficult to control and shoot because where you're shooting is where you're gonna start turning. Let's just get some missiles in there. Let's just start destroying these blocks, but we can't because we turned it off in world settings. So we can keep on going. If I turn off the thrusters, if I just come out of this camera, go into third person, it's very disorientating to actually try and get it right. Oop, oop, oop. There we go turn off the thrusters, I believe that removes the actual limit and it does become very difficult to go up hills if we do. As you can see there, we only have what, 10 meters a second maximum. We could go higher, I will go higher in a second, but this is basically what we're doing. If I put number seven on there, we can go a little bit better. We have a little bit better controls because that enables us to use the gyroscope in order to move. But that is generally it for this mod. There's not much else to it. It's just a fun little neat mod for you to play around with. It's not fast, it's not practical. It could be a little bit of fun in multiplayer if you had a little duel with these things. But, but yeah, it's in the description below if you want to try it yourself. I'll be back with another video some point soon. Bye bye.